This is our second episode of Elena Transform. I'm just trying to make sure the camera can get a good shot. Okay, today I will do a model Predacon who was a slightly tour and repaint, a considerable repaint of Transmetal, Beast Wars Transmetal Megatron. It came with two Minicons, Sideburn and Skids. So we'll start with the minicons. It's been a wee while since I last transformed these, so it might just take me a little bit of time. Like I say, it's been a wee while. Because usually I don't usually these guys are a little bit floppy, so I don't really tend to transform them very often. In their day, these these little guys, when they originally came with the, I think it was a street race pack, if I'm remembering correctly, they were essentially regarded as very articulate. Although that didn't really make them any, any better of a fit and any, 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 any good. There's one. I'm trying to keep it in short if I can. I said, it has been a while since I last transformed these guys. You have to bear with me. I've got the originals as well, somewhere. I'll have to dig them out. Right, on that skids. Bear the beat. Now to Megatron. Well, Predacon. I prefer to call him Megatron. As you can see, he's a robotic T Rex. I'll just move these little guys out of the way. He does have the flight mode, which is basically. Bring that up. And there you go. A local bleeding dinosaur. Yeah. Okay. I get to transform him. It's really quite simple. First, try to. You just have a fair bit of kibble. becomes his weapon. I am I'm trying to keep him in shot. Like I said, it has been a while. I got all that in short, or at least most of it. And then his, his 
whip of doom or gun of doom. There you go. Play the command or command the Megatron if you prefer to have them in that way. Not a bad figure. Well, he is articulated, and there's his arms, obviously, his legs. And this, well, his head is supposed to have some articulation, but the nature of the transformation tends to block that. But I think you can get a wee bit, there we go. Just a wee bit there. Oh. I think the Minicon's a bit drunk. His weapon doesn't fit, doesn't really sit 100% well. It's a bit floppy. Oh, he's, you know, all his, he really is quite, he's, he's, well, he's essentially in pretty excellent condition because I don't, after all, I don't really play with him much. Them all back. Start with the mini cards. Basically, just lift this. And Megatron's drunk as well now. Energy on overload. Yes. It's pretty don't have anything. That's a camera track. <sighs> oh, actually, my budget's a bit limited. I can't really afford anything super fancy. So I am doing this. Is why not? Make sure to line up this bit here so that this closes. And make sure to line up this part here. Somehow. I always seem to have trouble with getting the head to fit just snugly. And I may have actually tucked the arms in on time. I don't think so. Almost. Be a little firm there. And there we go. On the Marta Predacon Transmetal Megatron, whichever name you prefer for them. So, okay, there we go. It's a Marder Platicon. So that's the second of Vayner Transforms. I'll 
pick out the which one I do next. Like that. Transforming. Whatever. Whatever. Whichever one you prefer. 